monitoring uh, radiation levels at the beach. Uh, there's actually a cell tower, although it doesn't look like one, right on top of the condo building. You can see the, uh, I'll just focus in here, but uh, right at the top of the condo building you can see these white panels. And if you have time, just take a drive down and you can see them uh, a little closer. But uh, anyway, those panels are, you know, radiating out uh, 2 and 3G signals, and I guess they're eventually going to put 4G on there, just like the tower in Southcott. So um, what I have here with me is a, a radiation meter, microwave radiation meter. And uh, it has peak settings, it has a fine setting and a coarse setting. I'm going to put it on the coarse setting. And you know what we want to be is close to zero. And when I turn this on, you can see that it's jumping up above 2,000. So when you see the flashing one, that actually means it's gone past what this meter will actually read. So in this case right here, it's over 2,000. And uh, if I turn the meter onto the fine setting, you actually hear what it sounds like at full. So people are getting that all the time. And uh, there's going to be a tower going up in Southcott, and that's what the um, radiation levels are going to be, about three or 400 meters from the uh, tower uh, in the residential area over top of the children's playground. So, you know, maybe people should think twice about uh, putting that in that area. So just to show you where we are again, we're over here right beside the river. And I was going to do one more little experiment, actually. So. What I'm going to do is I'm pointing towards the building, as you can see, and it's going above 2,000, and I'm going to turn around and see what it has. And if I put it down with my body between, it actually is going down to 300, which means that the radiation is actually being absorbed by my body. And you can see if I turn back around here with the uh, condos in the distance, you can see that it goes over 2,000 again.